This particular unit is the Panasonic Aquaria K-Series. It's the high performance unit from Panasonic Aquaria K-Series range. This particular model is our 5 kilowatt unit. It's installed inside our business premises purposely so we can share products information online with you guys. And, you know, it helps us improve our products knowledge also. And in doing so, it enables us to share even more information with you, you know, related to the K-Series. This particular unit of, of ours, it's connected to the 185 litre Panasonic Aquaria All-in-1. So that, if you've not seen the videos yet on the All-in-One, it is the, it looks like white goods, um, so it's an integrated tank that is purposely built to blend in with your kitchen or utility room, or even just to be, you know, housed in the area cupboard. But inside it, it houses the 185 litre, in our case, the 185 litre hot water tank and the hydraulics for the system, so the expansion vessel, the circulation pump, um, your magnetic filter, flow sensor, your temperature and pressure relief valve, and your PRVs in there as well, um, amongst other things. But it's very, very spacious inside the, the hydraulic area, so it's great for future maintenance for ease of access to components where we're going to be doing servicing. Um, this being a single fan unit, it can go 50 meters away from the indoor equipment. So in a retrofit scenario where it's challenging to put the heat pump close to the house or close, close to the building, um, it can actually go up to 50 meters away from the indoor equipment. Now that applies to the three kilowatt, the five kilowatt and the seven kilowatt units. They're all single fan. Um, the larger units, the double fan units, the K-series T-caps, they can go up to 30 metres away from the indoor equipment. Now, the indoor equipment, depending on your choice, you may want um, the all-in-one, or you may prefer to have the by-block and the cylinder option. So that means that you'd have the wall-mounted by-block, which is your hydraulics, um, and then also you'd have your Panasonic Aquaria hot water cylinder, which may be the 200 litre or the 300 litre. However, we have had some clients that want a larger cylinder. So in that instance, it has to be the K-Series with the bi block and a third party 400 litre cylinder, for example. So you can have a larger hot water cylinder beyond the 300 litre Panasonic Aquaria one. Um, it just has to be. It just has to be third party, unfortunately, but it works exceptionally well. The only thing we'd say is try and make sure it's got a large coil inside that tank so we can get high gain, high efficiency for it. Um, there are some third party cylinders that do a three metre coil, for example. Great. We know we're going to get great efficiencies. Um, so if you are going beyond 300 litres on your hot water sizes, you know, you've got a big family. Or, or high hot water demand, then, you know, third party cylinder with a three meter coil, fantastic. So, <clears throat> so with the K-Series, it's in the anthracite gray finish. The anthracite gray, it seems to be becoming more and more common because it just blends in so well architecturally on most UK homes. Um, the size of our unit, it's 795 millimeters top to bottom and 895 left to right. So it's not imposing in the garden either. The thing with the K-Series, you've only really got the fan, the fan motor, the printed circuit board and the compressor um, in, the, in the outdoor unit really, amongst a couple of other things, but the majority is in the hydraulics in the all-in-one. Um, so whereas a, a monoblock unit may be bigger because it's got the circulation pump expansion vessel, etc. All what's in the all-in-one would be inside here. Um, you know, so I do like the simplicity of the K-Series and how it connects to the indoor equipment is by quarter-inch and five-eighths um, copper refrigerant pipe. It comes in a coil, so it's twin pipe coil, 20 metres. We usually get ours, it's called Coolio, we usually get ours from FSW. Um, 
and it works exceptionally well. So it's just two flare connections onto the outdoor unit um, and two flare connections onto the indoor unit and that, that's your refrigerant pipe with connectivity done. If the indoor and the outdoor equipment is only 10 metres apart, the factory sealed refrigerant is plenty suffice. So you don't need to add or weigh in any further refrigerant. R32 refrigerant this, by the way. Um, however, if it's going further away, then beyond that 10 meters, for every other meter we would add, depending on the model, it would be 25 grams per meter or 30 grams per meter, depending on the model. Um, by the way, I say quarter inch and five eighths copper pipe work on the smaller three kilowatt unit, it's quarter inch and a half inch. Um, so, so really, as I say, the single fan units, they can be a solution um, to, you know, to where it may be challenging to have a hydraulic connected heat pump um, could, because it just needs to be too, too far away and then all the pipe work for the hydraulics will be too expensive maybe. Um, so the K-series really does overcome those kind of challenges and that's why I like it. You can put it further away. Um, and, you know, so 50, 50 metres with the single fans and 30 metres with the larger uh, TCAP models. Absolutely fantastic. Great, great performance. They are called high performance um, for a reason. They really do deliver big on efficiency. So if you are interested in the Panasonic Aquaria, please get in touch. If you're an installer looking for an umbrella scheme, um, to, to support you with your projects for your clients and you do want to fit Panasonic Aquaria, get in touch, we'll be happy to help. Thanks for watching.